<laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to the vlog. The last video we were doing a road trip, we were all over the place, but this video we're just gonna be in New York. The next two days are gonna be really exciting. We have work that we have to do, we're going to a trade show, which is gonna be really fun, so I'm gonna try to bring you guys along to that and share as much as I can. We have some self-care moments and we're throwing a party. So I'm gonna bring you guys along for all of that and it's gonna be a good time. Before we get too far into this video, I need to thank the sponsor of this video, which is Skillshare. I've been using Skillshare for probably over a year and a half at this point. And the way that I use Skillshare is essentially just how my brain works. I get really fascinated by things and feel the need to implement things into my life the minute I'm curious about things. So because of that, I need somewhere to actually learn about things and learn about how to implement them into my life. For example, um, knitting was one of them, podcasting, another one, different forms of journaling I'm really interested in learning more about, and currently my fixation is on front-end web development. I think mostly because I minored in it in college and I can just feel it slipping out of my brain. So now I just want to prove to myself that I can still understand the whole world and kind of start remembering some of the basics and building blocks of building a website. So luckily for me, Skillshare has thousands of online classes so I can actually learn about those things and implement them. And right now I'm taking the CSS Essentials class, um, which I'm really enjoying. Updates to come. As always, I have an amazing offer for you guys. The first 1,000 people to click the link in the description get a one month free trial to Skillshare. I would just do it now because it runs out um, and Skillshare is just the best. <laughs> I have been loving Greek yogurt for breakfast recently, so trust me, there's Greek yogurt under there. And then I have purely Elizabeth granola, hemp seeds, cinnamon, and honey. And it's just so good, and it's good for you. I get the Chobani Greek yogurt. I'm going to a trade show today. It's a packaging trade show. Um, Zantori was going for his business, his family business that he worked for and I decided to tag along because something that I'm working on, it's actually a very relevant thing for me to go to. So I got a ticket and I'm gonna pick out a business casual outfit and then we're gonna sprint out the door because I have to leave in like five minutes. Okay, so I have these black pants um, and they have a little slit here. I feel like these would be nice and then okay i have this vest and the back is just completely open but i think i could pair it i think i could pair it with this i don't know let's try this fit on okay guys this is the outfit that i landed on these pants are honestly so great for like business but still fashionable i think um i'll link them and then I just did a white tee with a little cardigan over. So let's go downstairs. lunch at the Javits Center. They had food trucks. All right, I'm getting my nails done. I'm sad because I love these nails, but um, as you can tell, my nail broke. So it's time, but I'm sad. I love them. I 
got my nails done. How amazing are these? Mickey kills it every single time. These are just so fun. Anyways, I was so in the mood for boba because we were talking about boba um, when I was getting my nails done. So I went to the alley and I got some, but they gave me a tiny straw. So I think I literally have to rip open the top and eat the boba with a spoon. And I also realized I got peach tea, but I didn't realize it's peach oolong. So I'm pretty sure it has caffeine. So I might honestly just save the tea for tomorrow and just eat the bobas as like a really bizarre afternoon snack. I do have a couple emails to do, so I'm gonna do those. And in the background, I'm gonna put on the staircase on HBO Max, not the actual documentary on Netflix. I never watch shows like this, but Mickey always has the best stuff on TV in her salon and she had the staircase on and I'm like so enthralled. So I have to watch episode one because I came at the beginning of episode two and then we'll go from there. But I'm gonna spoon out my boba, get some emails going and enjoy. Zan's getting his hair cut right now and I love his long hair so we'll see what his short hair looks like. It is 11 a.m. on Friday. I worked out this morning, which I'm really proud of. And I got a smoothie and then I showered. And now I'm at my desk starting to do work. I'll show you kind of the setup in my journal. So this is usually the setup I'll do when I have like timed things throughout the day. I've showed you guys this before, but usually I'll fill out a to-do list and then basically slot them into my day. So I know they'll actually happen, especially Again, when I have appointments and I need to drop things off and etc. So I'm gonna build out this calendar to hold me accountable. I just got a desk computer stand, which I'm really excited about because I feel like I've been hunching over, but um, my friend Austin gave it to me because he's moving today. It's so important to me just starting my day with a to-do list. So I'm gonna get to that. I'm actually working with a couple different sunglass brands coming up, which I'm really excited about because I honestly live for sunglasses in the summer. Um, and also I have a prescription. I'm going to Lens Crafters uptown um, to get fitted, not fitted, to pick out like a pair. I just put on my Shishido sunscreen. I'm really trying to be good about sunscreen because literally every dermatologist is kind of just like, you're an idiot if you're not wearing sunscreen. Here's the fit. I look like a little camper. Okay, this movie is amazing. It's called The Booster from Pliables. 10 out of 10 recommend. And now we go home. I just got a giant croissant and I am so happy. Oh my God, yes. <laughs> I just came back to these flowers. How sweet. Also, just because we're here, um, rug update. You guys know I was not happy with the orange rug, which is actually right there. I'm in the middle of selling it. Um, it was a beautiful rug, but just the orange just wasn't the vibe. I ended up getting a jute rug. I was scared it was going to be uncomfortable, but it's actually really comfortable and it like doesn't shed. And then I paired it with this rug that I already had. And then um, you guys might remember I had this chest as my coffee table but it was just too small and like clunky in the middle of the room so i found this guys both the rug and the coffee table were from facebook marketplace um but i love it because the bottom i can like completely customize without having the top of my coffee table super cluttered like even when there's nothing on it it still is really fun i have like wax on here i don't know why um but I haven't actually designed the bottom. I kind of just put like random books and journals and stuff that I had. Yeah, that's my update. 
I also got all of these ridiculous decorations, but I'm gonna just bring you guys to decorate, so you'll see them as we do that. And now we get ready. Hi guys, happy Sunday. I didn't really vlog yesterday, but it's a really nice day. I'm shopping at the grocery store so I can make some oats this morning. We love a good refill. The Myers lemon clean day just always hits. I just got back to my apartment. It is Sunday morning. Um, I stopped at the grocery store on the way. My favorite grocery store in New York City. It's called East Village Organic. A bit pricier. I don't go for like a whole grocery shop, but when I just need like bananas or kale or like supplements or anything, that's my spot. It's on 7th and 1st. Anyways, something so annoying just happened. I'm gonna show you. I'm so mad. I ordered this shirt for the going away party from Brandy and it got here the next morning and it took so long to send out. But I went into the stores in the city and they didn't have them so I ordered this and it's so cute and I would have worn it. Oh well, maybe I'll wear it today. And then 
Brandy also has these really cute boy shorts. I like shopping on the website more now because they have everything, whereas the stores have pretty selected inventory. But I love it. Who remembers when I used to work at Brandy Melville? It's scary days. And then I have two other boxes. So I'm gonna open these. I just opened up these goodies from Caudalie, and then I got a sunscreen from First Aid Beauty, and I was just talking about sunscreen, so. This is my junk chair, aka when I'm getting ready, all of the discarded items go here. So, we have a lot to do. We have sneakers over there. I'm gonna light this candle from Nest. It's their charcoal, and get moving on this mess, because it's scary. OMG, okay. The chair has been cleaned. We have Zan's golf on. And we have this amazing breakfast. Zan makes the best steel cut oats. We have cut up banana. Um, I just got these from East Village Organic. Honey syrup from Maine. Cinnamon, hot cocoa, granola. Vibes. We have made it to Central Park. 